My beloved love, I can't find a better way to describe it. It's like you're being pushed to reveal your new version of self to the world, to reemerge back into the consciousness of others, back into community, back into connection with others, socially, platonically, or romantically. Whereas the divine masculine is having those types of 3D external distractions removed from his life to push him into that deeper self-evaluation. And I see that these things very much go hand in hand. But I now see that you are being guided to allow others to show you through action, particularly in romantic scenarios. Allow the masculine who is either in your life, who is coming back, or who might be futuristically coming, whoever this is to you. Allow them to show actively their love, care, and support for you through their physical 3D action, regardless of what you are receiving from them. Of course, I do channel many different people, situations, and energies throughout these reading videos. So always use your own intuition and only take what connects with you in a personal and intuitive way. I'm starting today with the, I was going to say, the Energy Oracle cards deck. That's where I usually start, and I don't believe in coincidences or accidents. So the fact that I was wanting to name that card deck tells me that I should absolutely pull some cards from there as well. But I am actually beginning with the traditional tarot deck. So I'm feeling a little bit of heaviness today that's a bit hard to explain. I feel that some of you may be sensing this as well. For whoever is feeling a bit of a heavy energy, I want to channel into this. I feel that for some, yeah, here we have the Queen of Swords reversed. This could be speaking to someone or forces around you who are perhaps speaking negatively about you. This card can sometimes connect with gossip or those who can't be trusted. So there may be energies around you. I'm hearing that are feeling triggered by your light, by your growth and who might be projecting some of their own insecurities, fears or doubts that are being illuminated within them back onto you energetically. And you could be picking up on that as some form of heavy energy. So again, I don't feel that I'm speaking to everyone here. Only take this if it intuitively connects with you. This also could not even necessarily be someone specific in your personal life. This actually could be a general thematic kind of message that your light generally is so powerful and so brilliant and so illuminating that it often reveals patterns of fear, unworthiness, and insecurity within others to themselves. And not everyone is ready for those revelations within themselves that your light subconsciously and automatically illuminates. And when someone is not ready for that illumination within themselves, that effect that you have on them will actually cause them, in a sense, to push against you in some way energetically, to reject you, to perhaps be triggered by you in some way. From Divine Muscular, Tyke Yes If You Believe.